with six matches to go in the Ghana Premier League, it's obviously getting keener, intense, hotter and expectant as teams battle for places in the upper part while others seek to avoid relegation this afternoon two sides with separate fortunes tamale city and accra hearts of folk take to the field here at the aliu mahama stadium to try and outdo each other it's on your on your screens and uh, they have given the indication by center referee ben kwame sefa it's a long ball towards hearts territory through the middle now and Accra Hearts of Oak who want to take the advantage but uh, Tamale City have looked strong at home let's see what kind of advantages Accra Hearts of Oak have as they come forward long ball threaded in by Lindam Tange is the flag up no the flag is not up but eventually the flag came up but missed clearly can't get it away from their phobians they still come forward drifting into the 18-yard box he sets up the pass unfortunately Beautiful cross into the 18-yard box, but went behind. Eduku goes round his marker. Still has the opportunity. Eduku goes round past two. That's three! And he scores! This is magical. Absolutely magnificent. Imaginable. This is absolutely sumptuous. Brilliant skill from the top scorer for Tamale City. Samson Eduku picks up the ball here and just look at the skill went round around it with cheeky ease and then when confronted by Robert Sowa he went past like a hot knife through butter but look at the finish it's all about the finish amazing skill to go past Anani here and he has the belief went round Sowa with cheeky ease went through like hot knife through butter City pick up the advantage through the middle Go forward once again. The flag stays down. Good enough for Tamale City. They are threatening into the 18 yard box. There's a slight push from behind. The referee has pointed to the spot. Amazing football from Tamale City. And again, it's Nafu with a lovely pass. And just when Sahadu got into the box, you don't need to make such tackles. It's Sadu Suraj with that push from behind. Lovely play from Tamale City. Good pass from Nafu. Yeah, you see that left arm of is just slightly at the back of Sahadu. He laid on the pass here, and Sahadu here was going to pull the trigger, but a bit of a push from Suraj and referee says it's a clear contact. Can Tamale City make it too? Will Nana save the day? Samson Eduku increases the goal tally. It's Tamale City too. Hearts of Oak nil. And Accra Hearts of Oak are noted for getting back into the game. Pass through the middle into the 18 yard box. Player goes down. Fasakoto was picking a perfect ball. Yes, for Bing Jr. Almost always looking for an opportunity to put the ball on that left foot of his. Linda just couldn't go around his marker. But Accra Hearts of Oak still have their noses in there. Bethy gets in a decent cross, but it was held in check. Caleb stands tall in defense, but Jack Basu has other options as they come forward through the middle. Jack Basu latches onto it. Tied it up nicely in defense. So they obviously need to lift up their game, but at the moment it's Yaya who lays a pass through the middle. It looks good for Tamale City. They are on a break now. Oh, Benjamin Nanayabua had to get a foot in for a save. Is it a bit too strong? Isaac went into the tussle. That is taken away easily by Tamale City's Ali Mohammed. Yeah, it's brilliant. Lovely play. A sign with that long pass. Goalkeeper comes out, plays the last man standing. Nearly gave the ball away. He's put Caleb under pressure. Tamale City! This is. They are tearing hearts of Oak apart. He's being embarrassed here. He gets the ball away, but he's not picking a perfect ball. He picks a pass, it's a poor one, and Yaya will say thank you. It's an easy finish for Yaya. Here, poor pass from Benjamin Nanayabua. But just look at the composure from Yaya Mohammed. It's an excellent finish. 
are still probing. They're just around the 18-yard box. This time, CC came off his line. Ali Mohammed, stumbling block. And they gift Hearts of Hope with a chance, an opportunity. Isaac. Fired from behind and Accra Hearts of Hope pull. One goal back from Victor Edu. Have stopped playing. The Hearts of Hope were coming into the game. Again, Isaac Mensa with that sublime skill. He set it up for Edu and Edu with a lovely finish. It's a brilliant finish from that angle. It's a bit difficult to beat CC, but he picked a spot. Brilliant play from Isaac Mensah to set it up for Edu. What a finish. Game will continue as Tamale City look to come forward. Benjamin Anayabua had come off his line and clears with the header. Tamale City come forward. This looks good. Aban to Agama through the middle. Aban! Oh! Raha to folks still have it though. Juggling it among themselves. Was the pass good enough? It's kept in play. And York was looking for the uh, overhead kick. Tamale City, they're still under the push. Hearts won't give up, not just yet. Into the 18-yard box. Linda brings it back and then it's whipped away. And the advantage and the heat is on for Tamale City. Drilled into the 18-yard box. Oh! That is the icing on the cake. That is the icing on the cake. This definitely will be a goal to remember. That is Isaac Mentor who drills the last nail into that coffin. Floated in nicely from the left. And look at the header. Goalkeeper Nana Yebua was completely beaten. And what a time to score this goal. Picked this spot nicely. Made it look so easy. And Tamale City will be smiling all the way to the bank. And referee. Benjamin Kwame Sifa brings the game to an end. It's been a very good hunting day for Tamale City. They have not only whitewashed hearts of folk, but they have mesmerized them with their game plan. It's been a game that Tamale City would live long to remember. But at the end of 90 minutes plus to add on time, it's Tamale City who win by four goes to one.